Thanks for joining us on another episode of Ask Dr. Kassir, where we review common skin problems and common aesthetic and dermatologic procedures. So we have received a lot of questions about dark spots. So we're going to go over the most frequently asked questions about dark spots. So one of them is, what is the most important question I should ask about my dark spots? We can get dark spots on the backs of the hands, on the body, on the face and so forth. Of course, the most important question is, is it benign or is it suspicious? You need to be evaluated by a dermatologist to make sure this is not a suspicious lesion that could be precancerous or a uh, melanoma. If it's not, then you can progress to other uh, treatments or lasers or chemical peels or any other modality that may address that dark spot. Another very common question is, for my dark spot, what procedure, which one of those above procedures do I proceed with? Again, you need to be properly evaluated after it's determined that your dark spot is not suspicious according to where it is, what body part, do you have any other conditions with it, how deep it is, is it superficial, is it deeper in the skin, what your specific skin type is, then we can determine do we need a chemical peel, do we need microdermabrasion, do we need microneedling, do we need lasers. If we're going to use lasers, what type of laser or light device do we need? Intense pulse light, Q-switch lasers, long pulse lasers, Alexandrite lasers, 532 KTP lasers. So there's so many different treatments you can have potentially for a dark spot. So in summary, you must determine A, is it benign and is it safe to treat? And B, after you do that, you weigh all those factors that we discussed. And according to those, you proceed with the most appropriate therapy for your dark spot and your skin.